as you can see, uh, it's considerable growth already. Um, it's probably about halfway, a little more than halfway up the chute. Um, the other ones are similar. That one down there, uh, even though it's in the tube, still uh, is probably the shortest of the three, um, but it's very bushy. And the one over here, still in the tube, is probably uh, the most robust overall in between, but this one is the tallest one. So I want to go ahead and uh, take a look at some of the things on this one uh, that are going on and some things that I had learned um, along the way. Uh, one of the things I'm concerned about is whether I'm getting enough water for these things. And um, one of the things I learned here is that this is, the tip of it is what they call the apical meristem. And you can see this piece right here, this little shoot that sticks up right here, uh, right there is the tendril. And one of the ways to see that and know that you're getting enough water is that the tendril is going to be longer um, than the apex there of the chute. So um, that's a very good indication right there. One of the other things that I'm having an issue with is uh, I don't know exactly what this is. I'm assuming this is what they call a sucker or a chute um, and I'm not sure if I should be pruning that right now um, or not. I mean it could be a tendril um, just a very large tendril, uh, which apparently is just a modified leaf or a specialized leaf. Um, so, again, uh, not having total experience in this, it's hard to know exactly what to do. Um, the other thing is, I have more of these, what I'm assuming will be, and I'm not sure how this is going to show up on the video, but um, fruit clusters or what might be fruit clusters or, or flowers clusters. Um, so I'm not sure whether I should be trimming this off now or if I should be waiting. So uh, again, more research to, to look in and to see uh, what should be going on. But that's uh, week three and a half um, and so far so good.